I really would have known how great I was as a player, I, I would have took better care of myself. I would have got more rest. I would have went to bed at night. I mean, I hung out late nights and had to play the next day and get up there and, and hit home runs. But I was very sick in, in, in my drinking and my drugging and, and you know, my amphetamines that I was taking and, and just the whole lifestyle. I was embedded in sickness for a very long time and, and, and I just realized that I had been troubled so deeply be, and scarred so deeply inside um, that I really just needed to get help. I had several moments, you know, of sitting around in, in my million dollar homes and, and by the pools and stuff and looking and saying, what does this all mean? You know, I have a bunch of stuff, got the homes, got the cars, but have no peace, have no joy. I went in rehab about four or five times, different facilities, to try to get well. I just wasn't ready. I was in denial. I tried everything else, but until I got on this path of my life and really surrendered my life to God and started living a real life away from all that stuff, um, it transformed my whole life and it, it made me the person that I am today. I don't miss the game because it's a game. Life is not a game. Life is a journey and life is, uh, life is more important than a baseball game. My wife and my children and my relationship with God is, is what exists in my life today. Well, it was a defining moment about 11 years ago when I met Tracy, my wife today, who I'm truly grateful for. When Daryl and I met, we were both struggling in life. We had lost ourselves. Um, I was fighting drug addiction and losing my children um, in alcoholism, and Daryl, obviously, as everyone knows, was fighting the same battle. We were living in my parents' basement. You know, you have an eight-time All-Star, four-time World Series champion living downstairs in the basement, sleeping in the bed that I went to high school. And we just, she decided this is it. We're not doing this no more. Either we're gonna live right or, or we're not gonna be together. And we did that and we came back together and, and it all worked for the good. Mm -hmm. We got grounded in church here. And I really realized that that was the most important gift that we ever had given to ourselves was becoming a servant you know, to others. Subscribe to the OWN channel today, and we'll see you on YouTube.